George Bulldog. And we're going to go through the steps of making this. There's various different ways you can do it. You can also make a bottle of it, but we're going to make a hat rack this time. delicate like this, you have to use your hammer as a guide. Hold it. Wrong code. And the next step we'll make his ears. And now, use my hammer as a guide. This is just to get it started. I may have to get me one more heat. 
What I'm doing now is just marking his ears. Now I'll get me one more heat now. Then I'll pull them all out. I'll get one more heat. Now I'm going to get one more heat, and then I'm going to pull the ears out, thin them out a little bit so I can turn them. What I'm going to do is take these few of those pliers and then the ends over to turn the ears. As you see, just bend them over. You can bend them over like you want to. Hold it. Let me brush that. Best to try to keep that slag knocked off as much as you can. Well, I've got to cut it off, and uh, so I can make my my uh, hat rack ears for me. Put it down the middle. Stuff and make my ears. Next step is I've got to bend one ear one way, one the other way, so that I can bring them to a point to make my uh, my ears for the hat rack. And the other one the other way. Now I've got to get some heat. Now I'm gonna bring each one of these to a point. Now, 
got one until a point. Now I gotta get the other one. Until a point. Yeah. Yeah, keep this kind of squared up. Draw them both out to the same length. Want this one just as long as the other one. Now what I need to do is bring this one to a little bit more of a point. Now when I'm gonna get a heat and straighten these back out. Now, like I want them for my hat rack. Be sure they're both uniform. I got one that's longer than the other, so I've got to even them up. Bring this one around. Now, what I got to do is get one more heat on it, then I'll put my name on it. Suppose you're reading it upside down now. for a flathead screw.